I am all in. How about you? Half in? No, I'm all in. All in! All in. Chester Elton here, and I'm with my dear friend Marshall Goldsmith, legendary Hall of Fame executive coach, three New York Times bestsellers. The accomplishments go on and on. But what I want to talk to you about today hmm. is your 100 Coaches Pay It Forward. Hmm. This is a group that's just brought together to make the world a better place. Tell, tell me how you came up with the idea. Well, as you know, our good friend is uh, Aisha Brussel, yep. one of the world's top designers. And she did a great program called Design the Life That You Love. So I went to this program, and as part of the program, she said, who are your heroes? Now, my heroes were very kind and generous people who are great teachers. Three of them are in our group, Dr. Jim Kim, who mm -hmm. you met, uh, Francis Hesselbein, and Alan Mulally. And then others included Peter Drucker and Richard Beckhard, Warren Bennis, Paul Hersey, just kind and generous teachers. Mm -hmm. And I thought, she said, why don't you be more like them? I thought, that's a great idea. I could do more. So I decided to adopt 15 people, teach them everything I know for free. And the only price is, when you get old, you have to do the same thing. So what we did is, uh, I made a little selfie video and put it on LinkedIn. <laughs> I remember this. Primitive 30 second video, yeah. and it said, my name is Marshall Goldsmith, I got ranked number one leadership thinker, number one coach, number one book. I'm gonna adopt 15 people, teach them all I know for free. And when you get old, you have to do the same thing. Let me know if you're interested. 16,000 people have applied, <laughs> over 16,000 have applied for adoption. Yeah. And now we've adopted over 120 people, and you've met many of these people. Spectacular Remarkable. people. I mean, the new ones are Pau Gasol, the famous basketball player, right. and then Chris Cuomo, CNN, and you know, we have the Brown Johnson from Sesame Street, the mission control director of NASA, and head of the New York Public Library, and head of the Rockefeller Foundation, <laughs> on and on and on. Just wonderful, wonderful people. And, you know, I love the project because we have three rules. No money. Right. No guilt. Key. No expectations. And I love the no guilt part as well. No guilt. No expectation. And the only expectation is when you get old, in your own way, you give back. And you've met the people. What are some of your reflections? Well, it's so interesting. You know, on a personal note, um, I, we were presenting at a conference together in Milan. And uh, Marshall had invited me to this group once before, and the timing wasn't right. And I asked him, I said, hey, you're still doing that. And he invited me. We went down to the World Bank, where I got to meet Dr. Jim Kim. Remarkable experience. And walking in, and this speaks so well of Marshall and his, you know, his giving attitude, I said, you know, Marshall, you send everybody their resumes of everybody there. Mm -hmm. And I'm going through the book, and it's pretty impressive. <laughs> and he says, I know what you're thinking. And I said, really? You know what I'm thinking? What am I thinking? He says, you're thinking maybe you don't belong. And I said, that's exactly what I'm thinking. And he said, and it was so gracious, he said, Chester, I wouldn't have invited you if you didn't belong. And I am so grateful that I've made such good friendships and the projects that are coming out of it, that are going to impact, I think, millions of people's lives because you were willing to give back and share what you know so that we can share what you know and what we know with others. It's just a remarkable gift. So thank you, Marshall. Thank you.